Hi guys, I'm outside the Queen Elizabeth II Conference Centre. The third year in a row I've done streams down here for the AGM for Rio Tinto, or at least the protests about the way that Rio Tinto are destroying the communities and destroying the earth and exploiting indigenous populations and countries with the actions that they're taking around the world. The conference itself, the AGM, is on today, obviously, starting closer to around the 11 o'clock stage. And this is the protest at the moment. I believe many other people are coming down. But the information that people can give is quite amazing. So I'm going to ask a couple of people if they can say a couple of words if anybody wishes to speak on live stream and tell people ah, the nasty stuff about speak Rio Tinto. To, speak to um, our visitors, Mami and Bernie and the Hi guys, in either English or French. French is better for us. This is live on the internet already. This is live, the video. If you want to tell people about Rio Tinto. This is live on the internet. People are watching live on TV at home already. People are watching. Ah, d'accord. Euh, donc, euh, on aimerait bien que euh, le film Rio Tinto euh, respecte un peu plus la communauté et l'engagement qu'ils ont pris par rapport à, à, au pays qui les exploite. Euh, normalement, Rio Tito est censé euh, se faire de, de l'argent. Donc quand on veut de l'argent, c'est-à-dire de business, on fait en sorte aussi que le sorte de ce business, on le respecte. Donc euh, on est là justement pour attirer l'attention de Rio Tinto que même pour respecter un peu plus leur engagement et faire en sorte qu'il y ait une, euh, y ait une euh, attente entre la population et cette firme. Merci. Thank you very much. <laughs> she didn't say from which country she's coming, I'm sorry. Oui. On you go. Pearl, Pearl, who speaks uh, before me, is uh, coming from Fort Dauphin, Madagascar, and she's the president of Fangumba associations that struggles a lot against the uh, Rio Tinto operation, way of operating and uh, land grabbing in our country. Thank you. Thank you very much. Any comments on Rio Tinto for people watching on live stream? <laughs> well, yeah, Rio Tinto has a long ways to go to meet their rhetoric, that's for sure. We're fighting a uh, proposed uh, project in, in Arizona uh, where Rio Tinto wants to put a mine in the middle of a location that's sacred to Native Americans and was withdrawn from mining by President Eisenhower back in the 50s. So for 50 years, their land has been off limits to mining and it's been sacred. And now the company comes in and, and says, we want it, we're going to take it and screw you. <laughs> Is that the climbing resort area? That we yeah, saw yeah, that's, yeah, yeah, the, um, it's Oak Flats. And, and in fact, there was just a uh, climbing competition there this weekend. There were more than 200 competitors, equal number of spectators there for the whole weekend. So um, not only would we lose the sacred site, um, and not only would it impact religious freedom for Native Americans, but it also would impact sustainable recreation. So, hopefully we'll stop them. Yeah, we will. We will. Eventually. <laughs> Somebody else uh, that we have stopped today, uh, a lot of the viewers might be interested in things like anti-fracking. And in the UK today, at 5 o'clock this morning, we closed down one of the anti-fracking or the fracking sites by people invading the land and climbing the drilling rig up at uh, Nottingham. Do you want to speak again? Oui, s'il vous plaît. Uh, on est ici pour montrer à la firme Rio Tinto qu'on n'est pas forcément d'accord sur leur façon de travailler et que qu'ils le veuillent ou non, il y a un certain malaise entre le pays où ils exploitent et la, la communauté. 
Donc on sait très bien que peut-être ce genre de manifestation, ça ne va pas forcément apporter tout ce qu'on a besoin. Mais moi, j'ai besoin d'attirer l'attention des gens dans le monde entier qui regardent qu'il faut qu'on soit solidaire pour faire comprendre à cette firme que le respect des droits humains, le respect de la nature, c'est très 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 important et qu'ils arrêtent de piller et qu'ils arrêtent d'abîmer et que s'ils exploitent, il faudrait une politique bien claire pour assurer par la suite le, la continuité de l'environnement. Thank you. Merci. And perhaps we'll have somebody sitting in one of the offices today that can translate and put a brief testimony of what was said in English on the website and I can better understand it myself because I don't speak French. Merci. But thank you very, very much for the information. Sorry guys, I'm doing live stream video at the moment and I understand you guys have a connection to a aluminium smelter and tying into Rio Tinto or do you have any information you'd like to share about your thoughts on Rio Tinto? Uh, you know, he is the man. <laughs> he is the man. <laughs> I speak not uh, very uh, English. Speaking Dutch then? This is worldwide. Oh, okay. What do I have to tell you about aluminum? Yeah, aluminum. We make anodes. Anodes are for the smelters. Yeah, the most smelters are in Norway, and there are a few in Iceland. Dan leveren wij aan en ja, wij hebben geen problemen met Rio Tinto. Dat is wel wat het is. Wij, ja, wat moet ik meer zeggen? Ja, meer kan dankzij, ik eigenlijk niet verdienen. Wat dankzij de, on, de ondersteuning van de Nederlandse government natuurlijk. Kijk, ja, zij gaat daar verder. Zij, zij kan daar beter verwoorden dan ik. Nog niet nou jij? Nou, dat is zo. Wij hebben, hebben Nederlandse wetgeving waar Rio Tinto zit. Speak up dan. Harder. Harder. Wij hebben Nederlandse wetgeving waar Rio Tinto zich aan moet houden en dat doen zij ook in Nederland. Daarvoor is het voor ons niet zo dat wij te maken hebben met de slechte omstandigheden wat ik hoor in de mijnen. En uh, dat is gelukkig voor ons, maar het betekent wel dat wij ook alert moeten blijven daarop om te voorkomen dat het toch door kan sijpelen en Rio Tinto ook mensenrechten voor Nederland zou willen schenden. Dus tot zover. Yeah, yeah. Thank you very, very much. Thank you. So guys, if you're in the area, feel free to come down. No need to bring pizzas or anything, because most people here are quite well sorted. And we're going to do a little bit of protesting here just now. So I'm going to get off and get this uploaded. And I'll come back with some more stuff shortly. Thanks very much for watching.